two weeks to go before jury selection is set to begin in the second Ray Tenzing murder trial. Of the thousand people who received jury summons, less than a quarter will be there on May 25th. So far, there have been 222 summons issued uh, and returned saying that those people anticipate being able to serve. 93 people have been excluded from serving because they are either over the age of 75, served on a jury in the last two years, or will be out of the country. The courts accepted 234 optional excuses, meaning people asked to be excused either for a medical hardship, employment or school-related issues, or they asked to be excused due to a past felony conviction. There were 129 individuals who requested a postponement of their jury service. Under Ohio law, uh, jurors are entitled to a postponement of up to six months. Uh, those requests were all granted. More summons could be returned between now and May 25th. That now leaves us with a total of 223 potential jurors as of now. Tenzing, a former UC police officer, shot and killed Sam DeBose during a traffic stop in 2015. The first trial resulted in a hung jury. Judge Leslie Giz could still grant additional juror excuses. Those remaining will be given jury questionnaires similar to the 25-page questionnaire jurors had to fill out prior to the first trial. Questions included, have you ever had any bad experiences with a gun? Do you believe an automobile can be used as a weapon? And what was the racial and ethnic makeup of your neighborhood growing up? And one issue that will be heard prior to the start of the trial centers around the T-shirt Ray Tenzing was wearing underneath his uniform the day of the shooting. It had a Confederate flag on it, and the defense wants that tossed out as evidence. Reporting live downtown tonight, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.